Hi family, welcome back to the girls world. It's always so nice having you a family. So let me just let you all know that this video is super late. Okay. <laughs> we um, did this project um, the earlier part of spring 2021 and now we are in fall. So it's kind of late. I did lose some files, but thankfully I was able to retrieve those files. Thank God. Right now, my husband is just holding out the bricks. Thanks, babe, for always embracing my crazy ideas, okay? Um, I love that dude, y'all. So yes, you do need 14 bricks for this project. And we do have the 14 blocks, not bricks, rather, but blocks. Um, we do have the 14 blocks out. And we are going to be also using our construction adhesive and our four by four outdoor lumber four by four outdoor lumber okay and to seal our lumber we are using this waterproofing stain and sealer they have varieties of colors but this is the color that we picked and we love it so my husband is just um um staining the lumber and let it dry before we move on to the blocks that's the first thing i advise that you do stain your lumber let it dry and then you can go ahead um stacking up your your blocks so right now the blocks we have not put on the con construction adhesive we just lay out you do want to lay out before you apply your construction adhesive so the first row of the black as you can see we have holes facing outward so on your left there will be holes on your left and there will be holes on your right those opening um is where your um four by four lumber are gonna go and then the rest of the rows, the hole is going to be facing downward. So it's going to be facing the ground. So two rows, the holes face the ground. The last row, the holes face outward. Holes on your left, holes on your right. And then one more black is going to be, you know, standing. Um, and that's where you're going to also put your 4x4 four four for your back rest. Okay? So now my husband is just putting on the construction adhesive. As you saw, we already laid out the block. We already know how it should be positioned before we apply our adhesive. You also want to evenly um, stack your blocks, okay? So you are not afraid to sit on it when it's uneven, <laughs> okay? Let me just put it that way. Evenly stack your block, okay? So that way it's kind of stable and it's not, you know, moving and make sure your ground is kind of level too. So we also painted the blocks white. You can paint it whatever color you want, but yeah, we painted it, painted it white. So now he's just putting in the four by four, and here is the bench. I will put the um, the link to how we build those planters. You can build your own planter, and you know, put some plants and add some screen lights to whatever you want to do with it. But, and I will go ahead and add a link in the description box below. Check it out and build your own planter, okay? So 
that's the bench guys we love it and you can add some pillows in there you know glam it up like i said we did this at the earlier part of spring now it's fall um we still have some work to do in the backyard but for now this is where we are and we are so content again thank you all for watching do not forget to subscribe do not forget to like comment you know share show your girl some love all right and i'll see you all in the next video bye